So the eye blinking induction is an induction that I learnt from uh, an old Ormond McGill stage hypnosis book many, many years ago. And what this induction is, is you ask someone to blink every time you say a number. So you say, I'm going to count from one upwards. And every time I count a number, I want you to blink your eyes shut, I want you to close your eyes, but I want you to open your eyes before I say the next number, so that when I say the next number, you can blink your eyes shut again. So you say one, two, three, four. And so it sounds really simple. And most clients will think, will laugh or think, how's this going to work? Um, this is just asking me to close my eyes when you say a number and then open my eyes. But what you then do is you start off counting one, two, and you start talking in a gradually deeper voice, a more relaxed voice, three, four. And then while you're doing that, you pause at times with the idea that what you're trying to do is get them to expect you to say the next number and then you don't say it and then you say it. So that frustrates their response. So one, two, three. So there's a bit of a pause there. So the person would be expecting me to say one, two, three, but because I didn't, they normally double blink or do something that because they were about to close their eyes because they thought that's what was expected of them. And then as you're talking deeper and you're dragging out the space between the numbers a little bit, bef normally before you get to number 10, they will have closed their eyes and they'll struggle to open them. And at that point, you just say, that's right, going deeper and deeper, going even deeper still. And then you just do your deepener. So you're bound to eventually get a subject who you'll say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and they'll still be going and doing it thinking, this isn't going to work. I'm not going to let this work on me. So what you can do with people for, thing, for that kind of situation is start adding, so when they close their eyes, so say 14, 14, deeper and deeper. That's right. So you just add something like the words deeper and deeper. The second they close their eyes. So 14, deeper and deeper. That's right. 15, deeper and deeper. 16, deeper and deeper. 17, going even deeper. So you just start adding that on. And you can always add other suggestions in as well. So my experience is that unless someone is intentionally being awkward and trying to prove that the induction is not going to work, which has occasionally happened, not just with this induction, but there's an induction uh, called the three things induction, where someone looks at three things that they can see, hear, feel, then they close their eyes, think of three things they can see, hear and feel, then they open their eyes, and you get some people that reorientate fully back externally again and they shift on their seat and they do everything they can to make sure that after every count they're fully awake. Or the induction where there's a really quick induction where you go, I want you to close your eyes when I reach the count of one and I want you to open your eyes when I reach the count of three. And you go one, two, three, opening your eyes, three, two, one closing your eyes and that's the induction but again what you get is sometimes you go three two one closing your eyes and the person closes their eyes and then when you go one two three open your eyes rather than them sitting still and engaging in the induction they'll shift on their seat and they'll do things that bring themselves fully out of hypnosis as a way of proving a point that your induction isn't going to work on them. So with awkward clients, you just have to add in some extra stuff. 
So it could be that partway through your induction, say you've reached 17, 18, 19, and they're still not going with it. You say, that's right, and each time, so between numbers, so say you've reached 18, you'd say 18, they close their eyes, open their eyes, and you say, that's right, and between each number, just let your eyes stay closed that little bit longer and let them get heavier and heavier. And so you just add in a few bits like that, and if they're gonna engage in the induction, then that's enough to make it work. If by, say, 30, they still hadn't engaged in the induction, they're still constantly opening their eyes and closing their eyes, you can then say, and on the next count, just let your eyes close fully and just keep them closed. And then you do, so what I would do is say I'd reached, I'd probably never let it go on to 30, but say 30 was the number that in my mind I'd thought, if it reaches 30, then clearly this person isn't going with the induction. And so I'd get, I'd say that by about 27, 28, I'd say, and when it reaches 30, I just want you to close your eyes and keep them closed. And then when I say 30, they close their eyes. And I go, that's right, going deeper and deeper, all the way into hypnosis. And as you do, I'm just going to lift up your arm. And then I'd reach over and I'd lift up one of their arms and I'd put it up in the air and I'd say, I'd move into doing a similar induction to another one that's going to be taught to you shortly, which is having the arm in the air. And I'd say, and don't go into hypnosis fully and deeply any faster than that arm naturally lowers down to your lap. And then I would do that as the induction with knowing that they're already partially in hypnosis. They're just being awkward. And I would do that as the induction as the arm lowers. And then when it reaches the lap, I would then say, that's right, all the way in hypnosis now. And I'd go with that. So that would be my way around having an awkward client do it during this induction. I'm going to count from one upwards. Normally I like counting downwards, but I'll count upwards. And every time I say a number, I want you to close your eyes. Between each number, I want you to open your eyes so that you're ready to close your eyes the next number I say. So when I say one, you'll close your eyes. And then you'll open them before I can say two. And then when I say two, you close your eyes again. And all you have to do is close your eyes with each number. Sounds really simple. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, one. That's it. Two. That's it. Three. That's it. Four. Five. Six, that's it. seven, that's it. eight, all the way, nine, that's it. all the way, deeper and deeper, deeper and deeper, more comfortably relaxed, that's it, that's it, all the way. And then one, two, three, opening your eyes, come back to the room.